Hi and welcome back to Assetto Corsa. So today we are doing something a bit different. Firstly, we just <laughs> woke up and we haven't had any practice today uh, uh, with this uh, beast of a car, the E92 Euro Fighter. And secondly, we have a different color. So as you see here, we are rocking a blue color this time. So let's get into the talk with you and see how we can do without any practice today yesterday I practiced a bit before my run so let's see how we can do today without any practice well not bad so far oh yeah I spoke a bit too quick but yeah I haven't made that, that transition from uh, those corners uh, since okay I have to be really careful with the throttle I think like the first part of the run I was uh, quite careful with the throttle then I started to press it a bit too hard I think and and uh, went out of shape real quick so let's try again oh Okay, let's uh, break. Let's keep going. Nice, nice, nice. Use the handbrake a bit. Back on the power. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh. Uh, and no, no spinning then. Yes. Wow. This was something like <laughs> I want to see this run. Like we didn't hit any corners, we kind of slid quite a lot, but we were all over the place. This this sums up my my uh, drifting skills right now really good because I I try really hard, but uh, my skill is just not there, and you will be able to see it in this run definitely. So how do I get to the run? Camera. Is this the run? I think it is. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's fun for it, but let's see. I use the handbrake here to slow down. Actually pretty good, I must say. <laughs> it looks really bad, but I'm super happy with the run, so... <laughs> yeah, I'll take it. Okay. Let's resume. Uh, let's restart, get fresh tires, fresh everything, fresh temperatures in the tires. Let's try not to hit the first cones here. Oh! That didn't quite work, and we hit, hit the wall there. Okay. I get it, I get it, I need practice. Okay, let's move the mouse down. Okay. Use the handbrake a bit to slow down. Oh, but... Uh, I kind of stopped my drift, unfortunately. Ooh. Ooh, and we got a spin. Okay. Well, that was that. How did I do such a good, like, these first two corners in the first run? Oops, hit the cone there. Oh, a bit too fast. Maybe I need to try to do it in third gear. I'm doing it in second gear. Maybe let's try to do it in third gear and let's be careful with the throttle. 
because second gear is kind of cheating. Oh. Let's try to continue, maybe. Yeah, but here uh, it doesn't seem like third gear is necessary. Maybe it is, I don't know. Let's try third gear. Yeah, third gear seems way too much for, for these, but I'm not sure. Let's try it out again anyway. Oh. How to get this transition, I don't know. But I need I think third gear is one of the one of the uh, elements that is needed to get that transition because you need to carry quite a lot of speed to go all the way from from one one transition to the next in that part I'm not sure I'm just guessing here to be honest oh, 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 oh. Continue, 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 continue. Huh? And you have a handbrake. And come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah, we're stalling. <laughs> well, it was what it was. It was not that bad, actually. For me. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay. Let's get back to the start. Third gear engaged and... Keep your eyes on the prize and spin a bit too much. Nice. We're getting somewhere, getting somewhere. Okay. <laughs> These in indestructible cones. Indestructible killer cones. Okay. How do I get to the start here? Okay, like this. To get to the start I have to press three buttons. First is restart, second is start, like to get rid of the get rid of the menu and third is teleport to a better position because yeah the restart like when I restart just like this I have this menu then I have to press one more button to get rid of the menu and if I don't press one more button then I'm just here and it's kind of tricky to move from here to here and there go Oh, can we continue? Let's go. Like how to get this transition? I don't know. Ah, it's so tricky. Okay. At one point, uh, I saw a video where a guy explains like uh, what what uh, using the brake, uh, like how using the brake, like the regular car brake, not the handbrake, can help you in drifting. Like what it actually does. Like does it stop a drift or does it help you transition or something? But I forgot that. And to be honest, I'm not using the brake right now at all. And maybe that's one thing that could really help me. Yeah, I went too fast there. Yeah, 
Yeah, seems like second gear is necessary for these corners. Third gear before that, and second gear afterwards. Seems like you need to shift down before the first floor. We can try to do that, at least. Let's try. So, third gear here. Oh. Oh. Let's use the handbrake a bit. No. Okay. Let's try again. Oh. Come on. You can do it. Get past these killer cones. Usually hit the right cone, so... I mean left cone, so... Maybe stay more on the left side. Nice, nice, nice. And now maybe slow down and shift to the, the second gear. Oh. <laughs> no, this is so hard for me. Okay, let's go first gear. Do a quick turn. Shift up to second. Oh. And across the line. What a great run. Let's go one more time. Okay, let's do the last last run. Full concentration, Ubu. Let's go from the start finish line. Drivers ready. Opponent ready. Yes. Three, two, one. Oh. Close the handbrake a bit. Slow down. Okay. Keep going, keep going. Second gear, not first gear. Let's get to the finish line. Let's not end like this. And across the line. Yes! <laughs> what a great run. Okay. Let's switch cameras and do some donuts maybe. The sound is different from the outside, that's cool. Let's go other way. And the other way. Maybe a 360? Oh! Kinda made it. Okay, uh, so... Uh, this was it for, for me for day. I didn't do any practice and maybe that was part of the reason why my performance was quite not there, but still... Yeah, we got a run uh, in today, we got a little little bit, like small incre uh, increment uh, better maybe at drifting and that's the goal, to get better at doing this, so... So, we kinda did something towards it today. So, uh, that will be it from me for today, thank you very much for watching. Let's put the lights on in the end, have a view from the front maybe. Oh, this car looks so good. Just the front bumper alone and the front lights and the grill and everything. I think this this design is quite uh, timeless, like it will stand... Uh, uh, it will still look uh, very cool a long, long time in the future, I think. Just uh, the E92 and of course also this HGK design of it. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. That's it from me today, Ubu signing out. Peace and uh, have a good day.